The federal government says it is working towards creating one million jobs for Nigerians in the span of five years through outsourcing. The Minister of Trade and Investment, Doris Anite, who disclosed this, said the federal government intends to achieve this under the National Talent Export Program, which the minister says is in line with President Tinubu's mandate to increase employment, boost trade and diversify the economy. The report. Nigeria currently has an unemployment rate of 5%. As part of efforts to address this, the Ministry of Trade and Investment says it is working on taking full advantage of the nation's youthful population to fill in the global gap of skilled workers through global service exports and talent outsourcing, which the minister says is an industry that will be worth an estimated $904.4 billion by 2027. With a youthful population and about 3 million graduates from the Nigerian universities every year, we are very optimistic that we have what it takes to support this industry. Nigeria has the potential to provide high quality talent for the global service exports and outsourcing industry. As a country, we have a significant value proposition for regional and global markets for the export of services. We will actively target green and brownfield job opportunities everywhere in the world. We are also taking advantage of the African continental free trade area to also target those within Africa and also be of service to the African continent. It's been estimated that by 2030, around 85 million jobs will remain unfilled globally due to skill, shortage, short, due to skill shortages resulting in a loss of about 8.5 trillion US dollars. Nigeria has a large, youthful and skillful population that can take advantage of this in a way that can significantly benefit our economy. The concept of outsourcing is not new as it was early attempted by the Good Luck Jonathan administration. However, the scheme was not given the necessary attention during the Muhammadu Buhari administration. NATEP coordinator Femi Adeluyi delves into the importance of outsourcing as well as strategies being implemented to ensure Nigerians truly benefit from the scheme. Now, the benefit of outsourcing is that not, uh, not only are jobs created, but the jobs are jobs that are currently outside the country. In other words, the funds that will be coming as payments to the people will come as foreign, in foreign currency. And we know that that is something we really need as a government right now. When you see that something is bringing incentives to the country, it's a thing that the government will want to make sure it's sustained. Right now, we need the jobs. Right now, we need the forex. And this is a good opportunity for that to be done. Anita stated that the National Talent Export Program will begin with 50,000 Nigerians and increase the figure over time. She further revealed that gender inclusivity will play a large role in the program as 55% of the beneficiaries will be women. Chamun Dabeng, Trust TV News, Abuja.